Hello world, I'm Glocarp, and welcome back to Shadows of Forbidden God. We're here playing as uh, the Broken Maker. Uh, we're on turn 254. Our world panic is quite high. Not really sure why it's that high, because uh, I think at this point world panic should be about 50 like normally. Why we're at 63, I'm not sure. Oh, we do have 24 victory points already, or 24% of the required victory points, which I hadn't realized before. Wait, where are we even getting points from? Any shadow population outside Dark Empire? Okay, so we actually have a pretty good... Uh, not, ooh, ooh, why is there shadow here? Alright, because uh, we had alchemists here at one point. Yes, 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 yes. Now, this uh, place here is pretty goodly. Shadow, uh, shadow is spreading quite nicely here as well, even though uh, it seems like the people here are putting up a lot of... Uh, yeah, they got awareness here, yeah, so they're going to be putting up a lot of... A lot of wards here, so maybe get that is not going to be moving around there unless we go and do something with that. At this moment, our uh, so I guess from Vera here is influencing this holy order. I believe we just got them to the point where they can actually do dark worship. Yeah, their elder powers minus two or plus two. Yeah, dark worship plus two. We need to get those candle circles out of here so that uh, they'll actually, you know. <laughs> not, not two things that prevent their own things. Uh, our uh, what's our hierophant doing? They're infiltrating the ducks over here. Uh, Bob's going to boost. Okay, that's where the hierophant is. So yeah, just gonna be working on that area there. Uh, the warlock, I believe, was being hunted. Was he not? Uh, oh, I think that whoever was hunting them has already stopped that. Okay, well that's very very nice. Uh, I think it was this person here. Yeah, and they're gonna go rest and resupply. So, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, they're the one that with the power jar. Yes, 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 yes. So yeah, he's laying low here because he's got a lot of menace, and we want to keep him alive because he's the prophet of that particular religion we're working on. And a harvester, yeah, is here weakening the walls because we want to get this place to be, uh, yeah, to be uh, shadowed. I was thinking we might do the Dark Empire here because uh, we're. Mm, are we gonna do that? Because if we use the uh, like, because with this god, uh, if we use the uh, the monarch we cannot use them in the next sleep that work or the next awakening next sleep I'm not really sure are we sleep? no we're, we're sleeping right now right oh our seal is gonna be breaking in three turns we're gonna see some new powers okay that's that's fine okay so let's just uh, get going oh Queen Zhong Tian uh what what which kingdom okay down here well that's just a little kingdom yeah we don't really care about this it's not there's really not much we can do here, like this little, like little nations with only the capital, they are always kind of difficult because, you know, their security is always quite high. But yeah, let's, uh, yeah, more wars, okay, where are these wars happening? Over here, uh, are you part of the alliance? Yeah, you're part of the alliance, yeah, the alliance is definitely going to be building wards here. Uh, we do have some ghasts in shadowing places here as well, which is always very, very nice, like it's already happening here. And this is the alliance, so I'm very glad about that. Okay, more wards. Yeah, yeah. They're building a way too many wards for mine. Ooh! Ooh! We in... Oh, wow! By 47 points, that's actually a pretty good amount. And what's this? A pleasant surprise. Yeah, we'll just take a pleasant surprise. I don't want to increase his menace or uh, profile too much. So, yeah, we'll just take the challenge progress. Okay, Bob has reached here. Uh, uh, maximum power increases to gain an agent slot. Okay, just an agent slot. That's, that's not that important. Like, we're gonna get another agent for sure. Uh, which makes me think, if we used to create agent, do we have corruptible heroes here? Uh... Oh wow! Oh wow, they've added that like... Oh, this is cool! Uh, this part that you see here, where it shows uh, their profile, Menace Gold, and what kind of stuff they have. I'm kind of maybe thinking of even getting the Mad Mediator here. Because then we could like double time on the religion. Hmm, uh, but we did put that one curse. Uh, which curse was it? Let's see. Uh, the curse of the traitor. Yes, yeah, so uh, can we figure out which what curse is the curse of the traitor? Uh, is it maybe the yellow one? Let's see, is it the yellow one? Uh, Alright, we can check on family. Curse a traitor. Okay. So what, what family is this? Uh, Jalat. So I'm thinking if we were to go and in shadow one of the Jalat people. I think like you're a Jalat person. Yeah. So if we were to get you to be in shadowed... Oh, by the way, you are in the shadow. Why are you not in getting any... Like, you're there. Shouldn't you be getting shadowed while you're there? 
Like, your awareness shouldn't really affect that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking yeah, maybe use some other curse, but then again, maybe I want to keep the curses around, like, we already used one curse. Of course, we could use the create agent masterfully. So here, uh, can only be used once per sleep. The curse power is hard, but not removed. So that might be an interesting thing to do, but maybe we'll just get a, you know what, you know what, let's get an orc, let's just get an orc out. Orcs are fun and nice and interesting. Uh, ooh, we got the uh, the primal font here as well. We should go drink some of the primal waters, maybe. Uh, where are the orcs? Okay, there are some orcs over here. Oh, that's a actually a pretty big horde. Uh, can we see, is there an upstart? Yeah, there is an upstart. What's the upstart situation? Oh, he's got a war warrior and a goblin. That's never a good thing. But, uh, he might get smashed. Like, he's already at 60-60. That usually means that uh, someone's thinking about smashing them. Yeah, well, uh, do we have any heroes close by to here? No, where are all the heroes? Where's no heroes over here? Uh, let's see. You? Mm, you got any desire? Uh... Okay, what's 60 profile? I wonder how far he can actually... And this is like a religious person, yeah. So they're not gonna be thinking about going and smashing the orcs there. But you know, let's just get an orc. I like orcs. Orcs are nice. Uh, we got a warlord. Over here. And we're gonna give you some more might, I think. Now there was a reason to give you more command for some reason. Oh, it's been a while since I last played, so... I cannot... Or, I mean... Before this particular run that we're doing now, so I, it's been a while since I used the orc, so... Yeah, I feel like there was a reason to give him command, because maybe it's like, if you give him command, get a manticore, you get enough command to get, like, three orcs. I think that might be the thing. Yeah, because if we look at this person over here, yeah, the orcs have, yeah, yeah, they use two from your command limit. So if we get, uh, yeah, if we get the manticore head here, uh, we're gonna have command six, and we're get, yeah, then we can get three orcs. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's the, that's the thing. That's the thing I'm thinking about. So let's see, uh, where do we have some uh, wandering manticores? Over there. Okay, up there you go, Mister Witite, and Bob. Yeah, you should be doing something over this way. Uh, is there anything smart you can do? Uh, so you are uh, infiltrating docks, that's gonna take six more turns. Oh, wait, 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 I re remember. Weren't there a skeleton key? There is a skeleton key on sale somewhere. All the way there. <sighs> yeah, that's like pretty much the other side of the world. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's like eleven turns to get there. But the skeleton is very good. It, you know, it drops security by one. In every location with the person and with Bob, that's like super good. It's not like we need this potion of lesser healing for anything. And once again, we're on endless. Like we don't, we're not really in a hurry to do anything. So <laughs> let's see if we can get something happening <laughs> with that, because I, I I really like the skeleton key. Okay, yeah, more people becoming aware. That's oh yeah, way too many people becoming aware. But I mean, people becoming in shadowed also was very nice. Uh. Harvester, are you still working on that? Yeah, okay, one more turn. So what is the situation with the war here at this point? It is, yes, yeah, so it's gonna drop to like a, yeah, okay, 66.5. Yeah, some religious tensions happening, I don't care. Uh, you got some menace. Yeah, just get, I mean, it's so low that you, this, this doesn't concern us. Okay, so let's have a look-see here. So now, the war is at 66.5. Uh, so they're getting, yeah, a little bit of shadow there every turn. And if we look at local actions, yeah, the ward against shadow. What? It's gonna... Yeah, ruler aware and nearby shadow. Okay, well, do you have a religion here? You don't even have a religion here. It'd be nice to get this religion. This religion moving here. Also, it'd be very nice if the witches here would just uh, keep prophesizing doom. It would be very nice if they would do it in locations that all... Oh, madness signify. Someone's here trying to remove the madness. Are you here removing the madness? Is that what you're doing? Uh, yeah, you gotta cure madness here is one of your things. Uh, okay, consecrate Abbey of Acolytes. Wait, this is a holy site? <sighs> okay, uh... Wait, why is nobody... Is, we've infiltrated this. This most definitely should be in Shadowed. Okay, you know what, Harvester? Uh... 
Why don't you go and in shadow that spot? Megan, what are you, what is this person doing? Oh, he, okay, right, he's just laying low. Who? Maybe, maybe, maybe I should wait. What is the situation with this dude? Oh, that guy would be very easy to beat up with the with the orc. Okay, well maybe maybe we'll think about that. Uh, but yeah, get yeah. Mm. Cause, I'm re Cause I kind of want to keep. S well, I mean, you're around here, yeah, 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 yeah. So you can you can deal with the wards over there. So you go and in shadow this particular basilica. Uh, these people are warding, yeah, because it's part of their relig religion. Uh, are you? I would assume you'd be going to perform. Why are you not dark worshiping? Oh, you just want to build build a temple. What about you? You want to build a temple? You want to build a temple? But yeah, some. Oh, you're already doing dark worship there. Nice. Okay, wards. Yep, people are coming away. Yeah, that's just just not very good. Ooh, I always like the favorable wins. Yep, yep, yeah, yep. Uh, ooh, uh, okay, okay. Well, people are getting in shadow. That's at least always very nice. Yep, the wards wards aren't very nice. Or awareness. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Uh, where is this awareness happening? Okay, it's, if it's just happening here, I don't really care that much. Uh. Because the shadow is, I mean, yeah, well, we have these people, or not people, these creatures who are doing the enshadowment. So that's, like, the wards, I don't think the wards really matter that much for this. Also, do the elves not create wards? Okay, yeah, they do have war, war against shadow. But wait, what didn't they have... Wait, you're a human being. Yeah, that's why you're... But, it's not like the actual elves. Yeah, the actual elves... They don't even have Ward Against Shadow as an option here. That's... Interesting. Yeah, I mean, I know because they have those... Uh, yeah, these things, these elf stones. That show that the actual elves don't get uh, shadowed. Because the stones get, but... Still... That's pretty interesting. Uh, have we used the cultists in waiting to every place here? Uh, right, all the cities here. Uh, we don't. We don't. I don't think we want to use it on non-city locations. Uh, cult in waiting. Yeah, we've used it there, and this one. We're yeah. We need to get the first place uh, actual infiltrated. We used it here. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, 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 let's just keep on going. Uh, we'll buy a trinket. Yeah, we don't have that much money. Oh! <laughs> oh, con another concealed dagger. Love it! Yeah, the concealed dagger was definitely like the best item in the game. Okay, more people getting in shadow. Very, very nice. So let's, uh, cultist in waiting over here. Boom! So this is now at security 4. And the idea really here was just to put that cultist in waiting there. Uh, I'm not that interested in uh, dealing with the rest of this stuff here right now. Yeah, we haven't infiltrated the city palace here. Uh, so go to the city of Musti and do the same thing there. Then I think we're really going to start preaching some gospels of violence somewhere. Okay, you're there, you're there. Ooh, order of truth can be... Influence. Oh, we're getting them to be neutral. That's always nice. Okay, 27% faithful rulers aware and non enchanted. Okay, wait, 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 wait. What is the religion? It is. Oh, what? What? Okay, I was like, <laughs> very small, but no, there we got stuff here. But okay, who's aware over here? Okay, we got people aware down here. <sighs> hmm. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So, Harfind, uh, you got to. Bribe some gods first. Bob, you gotta buy that skeleton key. Okay, that done. Uh, switch that for that. Oh, the first daughter calls. Oh no, 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 no. This is the uh, this is our orc man. He got he went and got the first daughter as a seer. Well, if we find oh, order of hope, nice, 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 nice. Yes, I'll accept this. Uh. So yeah, we're gonna give you the, uh, remove your candle circles. Yeah, so you're most definitely not gonna be doing wards there anymore. 
That's very, very nice. And yeah, you're doing the Dark Worship, yeah, four more turns. Uh, the fun thing about, uh, as far as I understand how Dark Worship works, is that it will push it over the sea to here. And then that's camp, maybe not because that's a camp, not actual human things. But yeah, these things are human things. So it'll push it over the sea if it can't push it to like these adjacent locations. So that's very nice. Okay, you have to infiltrate the docks. It's gonna take 17 turns. Uh, it takes a long time to do this in these locations, but yeah, just putting that cult in waiting there feels to me like it's a good idea. Wait, what are you, what's your city here? Security is six. You're completely surrounded by orcs. Uh, you're probably not gonna have a good time over there. But yeah, I'm kind of thinking, do we have shadow here? Well, there's a little bit of shadow there. Like, if we just started infiltrating these locations, what's the religion here? Let's just go to Pramen Village there and start infiltrating from there, get that uh, religious area under our control. But yeah, you got that daughter there that is kind of annoying. Uh, but then just uh, defeat a Manticore, please. Okay, more wards. Shadow driven back. Where is this happening? Oh no, they're destroying those temples there. Which is kind of annoying because uh, they're going to be... Uh, yeah, they are going to be rebuilding those temples there as well, so it's kind of annoying. Mm. Then again, didn't we, did we remove your desire to uh, preach? No, but maybe we should. So what are you doing? You're going to rest and resupply, and then you just want to do some dark worship. What about you? Oh, you just already want to do some dark worship. Oh, but no, you're going to go preach faith at Possum Convent. Oh, down here. Interesting. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Oh, uh, what are you doing? I, I would very much prefer if you just didn't spread your religion around here anymore and would just focus on spreading the madness here. It would be much nicer. Uh, but uh, it's it's fine. Okay. Okay, you were here to in shadow. Oh, we should most definitely do the malign catch as well, but yeah. Uh, let's start with... Oh, we can't in shadow because there's a ward here, right. Well, let's start with the malign catch then. Uh, and yeah, the Harvester is very likely going to die pretty soon, like someone's gonna decide to just come and attack them because they got so much menace. Uh, the profile is very low though, so that might be good for us right now. Okay, yeah, 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 wards and awareness. Never a good thing, but... Uh, maybe we can get something happening, but yeah, you should start infiltrating there. We should really maybe murder someone and just escalate the thing to the vendetta afterwards. But yeah, wait, we're getting the orc. The orc's po point is very much to just murder people. So, that's very good. Uh, where, oh no, was that, a, was that a bad version of driving the shadow back? Did you get it to zero? No, you didn't get it to zero. So you didn't consecrate here, even though it is a holy site. Interesting. Okay, uh, more lore for uh, the harvester, please. We can influence the line circle again. Uh, you lay low. Okay, that's very nice. Hey, you are now 20% world shadow. Woohoo! Uh, yeah, would like to be a lot higher, but we are gonna get there. Okay, moral tenants. Uh, let's just... I don't know, if you have, like, this thing... I mean, yeah, we got people who are in this religion. So let's just start making them more warlike. Uh, that's going to be just fine. Okay, so what is the situation here with the ward? Oh, we're already at almost 50% in shadow. Yeah, the ward is big here, once again. So you go and weaken that ward, please. Now more wards. Heroes redeem. Okay, uh, is there anything we could use our power for that would be, like, smart? Uh, we can just bury more of that once we get hit 6. Okay, so you infiltrate the farming community over here. Okay, city of Alphageb. Uh, you're at three, so if I just put Bob there, you're gonna be at one. So if I go to Saray Castle, for instance, and infiltrate that, then this city will be very easy to infiltrate. Yeah, okay, so go to Saray Castle first. Wards, wards everywhere. Chosen one redeeming a ruler. Okay, this is bad. We're gonna see who she is uh, actually trying to redeem. The alchemists! What's the shadow here? 
Mm, zero, but yeah, let's deceive the fools! Always deceive the fools! Okay, Duke Bites <laughs> is in shadowed. Right, uh, so which queen... Oh, this is, uh... Huh. I mean, this is just a very small nation here. I don't really care if you're wasting your time doing, like, silly things like that. I mean, sure, it's gonna remove some of the shadow here, but once again, we do have this desecrated holy site here that will just push that shadow over this way. Uh, it's this place infiltrated. It is... Oh, the security... Oh, bloody hell, we should have most definitely gone here and infiltrate what the security was zero, because it's gonna... Yeah, it's gonna jump to, like, a very high number and... Uh... Oh, the deep one called as well. Ooh, we should maybe do something with them. Okay, okay, okay. So, Bob, yeah, you just infiltrate that fortress. Uh, I'm kind of just thinking about starting a plague, but then again, if I'm gonna do the Dark Empire here, like, it's not gonna be a very big Dark Empire. I should just definitely try and get some shadow this way as well. Uh, yeah, I would, maybe I don't want to start a plague here for that. I should probably figure out a place where to start a plague, because plague's good. Plague's a very good thing to get the, uh, uh, like the heroes to work on that instead of working on anything. Okay, so what is 6 to 6.5? Uh, what is the... Cause there is a, like, limit to what it needs to be so I can actually do the in shadow. Uh, what is higher than 50? Okay, so how long will it take for you to get that ward lower than 50? So it needs 6... Okay, 16 and a half, so that's uh, uh, 9 turns. Okay, if you could do something for 9 turns... Uh, that would be very nice. Uh, hmm. I mean, you could just drop all your gold there. I mean, you could just do some dark worship. Like, the menace from that is pretty high. Or, honestly, you get, you, let's just get your profile low. Let's just lay low, get your profile to be zero. Uh, you're stealing XP from this person and driving them crazy. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, hero redeemed. Yes, yeah, those two people have been redeeming each other like the entire game. Uh, and once again, yeah, this does not concern us. We don't care about her menace because uh, it's so low. Okay, thank you for the Manticore trophy. Right, people being in shadow. I just love it. Okay, we get we're at six power, so let's just bury some more power. Uh, you know what, let's bury some power over this way, because uh, we're probably going to work at uh, this area as well later on in the future. So let's get some power buried here. Now, Mr. Warlord Man. So, do we got any ogres around here? Uh, wandering ogres. Okay, there is a... Okay, they're up there. Uh, okay, well, let's go grab ourselves an ogre from there. Then we're gonna go and grab the axe from her. And then we're gonna... Ooh, actually, we might see if we'll just smash this... This... This upstart here. Because it's, it's a new upstart, so he doesn't have any... You know, he doesn't have any army yet. The easy... Deceive the fools! Uh, and it, oh, it already had like 20. Oh, cause I'm pretty sure. Did you already manage to do your dark worship there one more, one time? Yeah, I'm pretty sure someone has managed to dark worship here once. Oh, now they're dark worshiping twice. And yeah, these places had wards. Didn't they? I'm pretty sure they had wards. Nope, no more wards. Uh, what happened to the wards? Oh... <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think I think uh, this must have pushed some of this because there, there most definitely wasn't twenty percent shadow here like a couple of turns ago. So I'm very much thinking that it's the dark worship from here that pushed that shadow there. Oh, it's so lovely, lovely! I love dark worship. Okay, you did that. More people. And we can influence them again. Okay. Uh, I'm wondering if we should just get him to like Elder Power three. Yeah, let's get them to Elder Power 3, so that if the humans do something on, like, stop working on them, it's gonna be harder for them to actually deal with any of the things we're doing here. Okay, we weaken the ward, right? So what's the ward situation right now? It's 63. Okay, and the enshadowment is at 50. What is your enshadowment? Okay, you're at 50% enshadowment, so I think that's the point where you... Yeah, you're... 
Hmm, it doesn't, actually doesn't change anything here, but, well, at least the war against Shadow isn't on right now. I thought at about 50s when there's, like, would stop working against that, but apparently not. Now, we could go and try to stab her once to get her to stop this uh, with our Warlock here, but, wow, we only have one hit point. Holy crap, how much do you need to... Okay, you're gonna level up pretty quickly. Uh, is there any death around here? A tiny bit, but not really. Uh, there's the Deep One Cult, though. I'm thinking maybe if we go and do something with the Deep Ones. You know, yeah, let's go. Or maybe Well of Shadow. Yeah, if we were the Well of Shadow, like in Jinheng Village there, I think that would be very useful. So yeah, let's go do that. Okay, Fortress infiltrated over here. That's very good. Okay, you were... That is exactly what you were waiting for there, yeah, just to get to your minimum profile. Uh, and then you were supposed to... I mean, you were supposed to do the uh, uh, in Shadowment, but since that's not a thing you can do just yet, so just create another Well of Shadows there as well. Yeah, that should uh, spread that shadow a bit. And Bob, now you should go and infiltrate the docks over here. Uh, did I do the Malign Catch here? I did. Good, 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 good. Oh, and Mr. Warlock. Yep, you well of shadow there. Okay, oh wait, is this the, uh... Yeah, I don't care about the ruler redeem that much, really. Uh, let's just protect the harvester. We have a lot of power that we're not using for anything, really, so... Okay, so someone killed the orc upstart here. So most definitely our orc needs to kill the orc upstart from here, then. Uh, could we just smash him if we just win? Okay, he's got two attack, two defense, so he's got a total of eight hit points. We got five, five attack. So we'd kill him in two attacks. Will he kill us in one attack? We got five hit points. He will not. So we can just basically go and smash him. Uh, where are you at? Yeah, you're over here. Okay, let's, yeah, let's just go and smash him. Oh, and we have the daughter as well. Okay, so we actually have some units, so that's going to be very, very nice. Okay, where is this shadow being driven back? Here. Oh, and that that's also an actual holy site, so yeah. This is one you actually did did consecrate. Mm. I'm loving this shadow over here. Uh, cause we did rock- okay, I was like, oh, we did nothing to get this shadow really here. Ah, uh, we did quite a lot actually, cause uh, we spent- We did this entire ruin here, and that's- What did it take? 5 times 7, 35 turns? Well, I don't know. 35 turns, and this is- this is like what happened afterwards. Oh, oh, right. Oh, we got our gas here as well. Okay, so yeah, we need quite a lot to get this. Oh, wow. Look, it's 100% in shadowed here. Mm. What about you? What's your situation? You are getting 100% in shadow. What, do you have any local actions that feel like uh, you want to do something bad against your uh, your ruler? Actually, against Sovereign. Obsession Elf. Disagreement about Elf. What? <laughs> okay, you really like Elves. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what your disagreement there was then. Okay, more heroes redeemed. Yeah, Sovereign redeemed. Okay, we're gonna have to go and have a look-see at what that actually did there. So, it was over here. Yeah, I mean, drop the shadow here to 50, but this is gonna get to 100, like, real quickly. Yeah, the problem is, well, the same problem we have here, because now they have the wards up there. It's gonna take a while before we can actually get that uh, shadow back there. Uh, but if we look at this now, yeah, what against Shadow? Uh, but it seems like the ruler away and nearby Shadow Valley is dropping because of her uh, enshadowment. Yeah, also, or or did they did they create more wards there? No, it's just a small ward. Oh, we could. All oh, right, of course we can. It's, it's this place is infiltrated. We can actually just uh, yeah, we can actually just enshadow it. Right, gotta remember that. Okay, Bob, you got a lot of menace. You should maybe lay low a little bit. Uh, we got any uh, ancient ruins here? Oh, there's an ancient ruin here in Saray Castle. Okay, so that is a very good spot to lay low then. Uh, she'll just do that. You lay low there, get your menace, menace down. Uh, Warlord, man, you need to attack the orc upstart. Uh, are you going to... You, no, you're not actually even going to get through the defenses of that daughter there, so... 
That's fine, it just means you're going to die. Thank you. Okay, dismiss that, parade the head, grab that, uh, start uh, subjugating all the places over here. Uh, I mean, this is a very small area, so it's not gonna take that long for us to subjugate all of this. Uh, okay, ducks infiltrated, will of shadows built in a couple of places. Uh, you don't have any menace yet, so don't do anything about that. Okay, oh, you leveled up there, Hierophant as well. Okay, get your intrigue to be five, and then you go and you. Well, I mean, you're not gonna do anything. I'm gonna use the power here to put some cultists in waiting over here. Uh, what is the security? It's still five. <laughs> okay, uh. You get a pretty high menace as well, so just go to Coven and deal with that. Now, Warlock Man, you get yourself some more lore and head to the city of Xiao here. Because, yeah, you can enshadow there. I'm pretty sure the water it will be... Yeah, it'll drop below so that you can actually enshadow there, like, immediately. Then you can lay low there and things are going to be absolutely perfect. Okay, that Abbey is uh, almost a situation where we can do bad things there. So I think I kind of want you to just... Uh, all right, we can do the in shadow mid here now. Yes, in shadow here now, please. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, more wards. Uh, we're just gonna proceed anyway. Like, I do not care about her menace at this point at all. Like, it's solo. It should have like absolutely no, no effect on anything. Okay, you just lay low. Uh, wait, why can't you recruit a crow? Oh, you don't have enough money. That's why. And yeah, you got to in shadow there. It's only gonna take three turns to in shadow. <laughs> Loving it. Okay, wolves well, established. Yeah, you just. Oh wait, what did I? I I I I did not even realize what I clicked there. I hope I didn't click abandon or something. I did that. Like whose event was it? What happened? I don't know. Ooh, hopefully I didn't click anything really, really bad there. Okay, ooh, we could do some opportunistic encroachment here, but yeah, let's just, uh, first of all, just do the, uh, subjugations here. That's, that's what we really want to do here. Okay, wards, wards everywhere. Way too many people are aware. Okay, enshadowment, nice. Ooh, a couple of enshadowments. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, then you're at 40, so yeah, at 40 you must definitely need to lay low, just just lay low. And, you, what's the situation with the Abbey of Acolytes? Uh, how quickly is the shadow growing here, two per turn? Uh, if you were to lay low to get your profile to be just uh, at zero, again, well, at six, yeah, it's gonna take a couple turns, at that point this should be at the situation where we can desecrate it, so... Let's let's hope that that's what happens here. <laughs> oh, we can deal with this again. It's always nice. So what do we want happening here? Uh, I mean, we could maybe get the candle circles to be like, even smaller, but what I kind of actually want is to influence their preachers negatively. But no, let's just uh, go for candle circles so they'll remove wards here if there are any wards here. Uh, also. Since you most definitely... Oh, I think someone just finished a Dark Worship, because uh, <laughs> this just jumped up quite a lot. Okay, so that means that we don't, we're not even going to lay low with you at all. You're just going to go there and desecrate that holy site. And uh, Mr. Orkman, you're going to get yourself some more might at this point. Uh, do you have enough money? to hire yourself an Orc Warrior. You do. Okay, let get yourself a couple of Orc Warriors there, then we'll go and uh, subjugate that last spot. Okay, Bob, man, your menace is... your menace is so high. <laughs> I'm getting kind of worried. Uh, did we put the Cult in Waiting here already? We did not, so okay, let's use uh, the Cultists in Waiting over here. And then, Bob, you go and just uh, infiltrate the rest of this location. Our <laughs> You're really working on getting your religion like everywhere, aren't you? Well, at least it seems like you're gonna be wanna be doing some prophesied doom here, so that's nice. Yeah, okay, let's have a look see what's the awareness situation really. Oh wow, oh wow, ah, this looks pretty bad. This looks pretty bad. 
Yeah, well, uh... One of the things you're at least doing, because I believe with your religion we have the, uh... Yeah, awareness of Elder Power, so yeah, just spread your religion and make sure that everyone... <laughs> or that no one is aware. Uh, and you guys, are you just doing... Yeah, some of you are doing dark worship at least, so that's... Awesome! I love it, love it, love it. Okay, you finished laying low, you finished laying low. Oh, that's your profile, just not your menace. Got yourself an orc warrior. Oh yeah, the awareness just spreading like crazy. Okay, what are you actually supposed to be doing here? Uh, wait, what's the situation? Okay, so the city palace needs to be... Ah, the security is still four. Hmm, because I'm thinking maybe we should go to a place that is actually infiltrated and just make... You know what, let's go to Queendom Zhao, which is you, because you're probably... Yeah, you're gonna go warn the world over here. Oh, there's some elves here. Huh. Should maybe try to get rid of them as well. Uh, do you have enough money to get yourself another Orc Warrior? I mean, maybe you don't need one right at this second, so... Go over here, uh, subjugate that camp. Okay, wait, so there's like this little nation here. Uh, what's your security here? Eight. Uh, could we get that to be smaller? Like, if we were to infiltrate... Yeah, we could get it to... Yeah, we can get it to six by infiltrating these two. And then when Bob goes there, it'll be at four. So if we bribe guards, it'll be at two. And if we then put the cultists in waiting in there, it'll be at one. So yeah, we could probably get this place to be uh, completely infiltrated. And not even use that, and like it will maybe even be that much trouble. Because uh, what I'm really thinking, if we would get this place infiltrated, we'll get the Hierophant here, make her like uh, violent and uh, envious. So maybe she would attack like some of the neighboring, like this neighboring nation here, which we could also try to make, you know, envious and violent. So yeah, if they go to war against each other, then the Orcs encroachment could do something here. Hmm. Let's let's see. Let's see. Uh, wait, where is this? Duke bites chess. Oh, this is in the Alliance. <laughs> Rally the mob for war. Nice, nice, nice. Ruler assassinated. Duke your meshi Therese. Interesting. Yeah, so you died. Uh, your family wasn't cursed, I believe. Ah, oh, it would have been nice if it had been. Oh, Duke bites chess. Wait, but Duke bites chess. You're gonna be dead as well, aren't you? Like this death here is you, isn't it? Yeah, just repeat that challenge. Er, okay. Are we? What's our H HP situation? Uh, ten. So yeah, let's just. Oh, her blade requires four might. Why do you have four might? Yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, it was Duke bites chess that also died. Okay, Kingdom of Frey. Yeah, there's a civil war in the Alliance. That's always nice. But yeah, why do you have... Oh, because you have three daggers. Right, that's why you have might four. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, what's established? Market infiltrated. Holy side desecrated. Oh, you're going even more insane. That's nice. Uh... So, uh, yeah, still need to infiltrate the city palace. Yep, let's just do that. Harvester, where are you at? Alright, you desecrated that spot. Yeah, your menace is <laughs> so high. So high. Uh, okay, and there was a holy site over here as well. So, yeah, get that away. Uh, this person is probably thinking about doing bad things to the harvester right now. Yeah. Oh, but you're slightly in shadow at least. Okay, we were nice if you were even more in shadow, which actually, since you're hanging around here in the area of 100% shadow, uh, you probably are. Also, uh, since this still needs quite a lot to get to the point where we can actually desecrate there, let's just build a well of shadows here while we're passing. Okay, more wards. Uh, yeah, you can join the rocks and the merry, get your uh, menace down. Uh, I do not really care about this. So just. No, no, actually, I do care about this. Let's just silence them. Or, you know what, I'm just gonna abandon the challenge. We did it only for one turn. Right now, I don't want the Harvester profile to grow, because his menace is so high, that if his profile grows, like, people are gonna start attacking him. Uh, yeah. You just stop that. Uh, are you... Oh, you're consecrating there. 
That's annoying, but uh, we'll just wall of shadows here. Uh, okay, what's the madness situation in this place? 75, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. Okay, where are my witches? Where are my witches? Where have they gone? Are they all just around he somewhere here spreading the shadow? No, okay, light them circle. Where? Oh, they're on this side of the world now. Oh, that's actually very nice. Loving it, because that means the madness here will... Wait, are you the family that has the insanity curse? Yes, you are. Okay, so what? In three turns, her insanity is going to start falling, so we can get that curse to be even stronger. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay, uh, Orcman. Yeah, let's uh, recruit an Orc warrior for you. Okay, what's established? You've lain low. You are. Uh. Who are you? When did you go mad? Oh, just now, I think. Yeah. And he likes orcs and deep ones and the undead. Well, it would be nice if it would be in this person. Honestly, yeah, we should. Yeah, this deep one call, like, it seems like no one really cares about it. Okay, you care about it a little, but if we go and drop their menace. By doing that one thing, uh, that's going to be fine. Now, are you, are you seriously just spending your time driving the shadow back from there again? <laughs> oh, you silly, silly, silly people! Oh wow, the shadow is like suddenly there's a lot of shadow in a lot of places. I'm loving it. Okay, uh, so what do we need you to do right now? Is well, you will a shadow there. Okay. Uh, you need to g actually, yeah. Let's go. Let's go deal a little bit with the deep ones there. Yep, uh, warrior recruited. So we're gonna give them some human appearance here, uh, which yeah, it's gonna drop their menace by twenty five. And if we look at her, like her desire to decimate them, yeah, it's it's less than twenty five. So that's gonna make it to a zero. Uh, and uh, if we can get the profile to be smaller as well, what's your profile? Oh, it's only nineteen. Yeah, that's not like that's like very little. Uh, but yeah, we must definitely need to get Bob in here and get this place infiltrated, that's for sure. Uh, what is he doing right now? Alright, oh, he's dealing with this city here. Uh, okay, maybe that's fine. So, Warlord. Yeah, let's just... Uh, let's go and do some opportunistic encroachment here. Get that happening. Okay, Bob infiltrated the city palace there. Very nice. Uh, so we can then... Uh, did we do the cult in waiting here already? We did. Uh, yeah, we can in shadow that with uh, with this person once uh, the time is right. And I think that with Bob... Uh, I think we're gonna have to lay low first. So what's the lay low situation in this place? Yeah, we did both of them like catch and then in shadow. Yeah, lay low is plus two, so... Uh, progress return to... Yeah, it's probably just best if you just lay low there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, the wards. The wards are everywhere. Okay, repeat that challenge. Uh, we do not have any menace on this person, so this does not concern us. Okay, a king died. Uh, let's see where that happened. Or here. Okay. Uh, who's your heir? Are they in shadow? Tiny bit. Uh, where are you? Okay, over there. Uh, who's your heir? Uh, just someone. Just someone. And you are consecrating four turns. Man, if this would. Oh, it needs to be 75, I think, so they can consecrate anymore. Okay, I don't think that's gonna happen, so we're gonna be, have to deal. Deal with that over there. Okay. Shadow Dream back. Where? Oh, shadows. Nice. I love Well of Shadows. Huh. Okay, so we're awake already. Oh, at turn 300. Interesting. Grants plus 2 to all stat, but kills the agent after 52 turns. I'm not really sure if that's good. Must target agent cannot be applied twice. Because 52 turns isn't really that much. The plus two, because even though it's plus two to all stats, it's basically just plus two a stat, 
because the way I play, I never use different stats for different things on characters, especially with this where we can twist flesh and very much uh, make our characters or our agent very specific. So that just doesn't actually feel that good. <laughs> yeah, kill your character to gain them plus two, considering the fact that we have the primal font here. If we wanted to, we could go, go get plus... I think the primal font also gives plus two to all things, and that's just... Yeah, it will last for about the same time, and it wouldn't kill our people afterwards. So yeah, that does not really feel like something uh, I'd want to be doing. Okay, you're driving the shadow back there. Why is the shadow at 99% here? I'm pretty sure it was 100% just a little while ago. Uh, which we should probably go and in, uh, infiltrate this area here. Okay, so... Deep one called... Yeah, minus 16. Yeah, okay, let's... Uh, let's Feed them. Let's feed the deep one some power. Oh right, that's gonna take a long time because uh, you seriously have no intrigue. Mm, but we don't have anyone else around here, so yeah, let's just empower the deep ones. Five turns, it's fine. Okay, you. Uh, could you maybe go and. Uh, well of Shadow here uh, as well. Yeah, I think the Harvester is gonna get killed pretty quickly. Yeah, with that menace, like, if we look at this person right now, yeah, they're very much thinking about at attacking the Harvester already. So, actually, yeah, let's use the, uh, intrinsic lifespan on the Harvester. Because I am, like, I am pretty sure that they are going to die pretty quickly. Uh, so, yeah, let's do that. Uh, and the can we do some more opportunity encroachment over here? Yes, we can. Uh, so that goes to this citadel then as well. It's once here. Uh, it's all zero defenses. Right, requires devastation and defense defenses to be there or to not to be there. Oh, I used all. God damn it. Used all of my power last turn. Okay, out of hope. So, yeah. Influence negatively, the candle circles as well. And yeah, then we're gonna do, go for... Yeah, we're just gonna put this to zero first and then get intrinsic... Intransigent faith. Uh, to be negative so that maybe these people here will stop warring. Are you dark worshipping? You are! Nice! All right, then we can influence the circle here as well. Uh, do we really want to influence them in any way? All right, yeah, 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 yeah. We want to give them the intransigent faith as well. Uh, make these people around here more likely to attack other people. That's always nice. And you are here, yes, to uh, empower the deep ones. Yep. Gotta remember not to actually. King Tere Bri has died. City of Ferre fell. Alliance Outpost. Oh, wait, Outpost? If we look at the prophecies here, there was... Uh... Oh! So guests from Varus who duel a foe in combat, they would become the Prophet of Convocation of Light. Which is a religion we haven't really done anything at all at any point, so we don't really care. But I'm pretty sure one of these was, yeah, Fund an Outpost. Huh... Wait, from the east, from the coast, is... Were you not from the coast? You are. So, shouldn't... Huh? This is including Bob. Oh, okay, just that wasn't from the east, right. So, okay. Don't really care about the outpost then. So yeah, they smashed this city here. Which is annoying. You could have just like captured it. That would have been more nice. Oh, there's a human soul here and an elf soul. Yeah, I mean if we were to donate money here, who's got in who's got the most money? You got 130 gold. You got a hundred gold. Like if we just went and uh, Yeah, if we went and dropped that gold here then this outpost would be in shadowed immediately. I think infiltrated in shadowed immediately uh, once once it finished being built. So that would be nice. We might do that. Okay, opportunistic encroachment, and I don't think you can do more of that. No. Uh, so at this point, 
what are we going to do? Well, uh, if we look at your family, you're the one fountain that's cursed with the Maker's Curse. Okay. Do you have anyone? Shang, that's your family, right? So, for, uh, what was family? Families, uh, or house? House, F3, okay. I already forgot what you were called. Oh, nope. Back to the game, please. Uh, what are we called? Shang. Okay, so if we look at uh, House Shang. Oh, wow, like that's the worst place to put a curse in. Er, 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 er. But hey, I just happened to look at how long this recording has been going on for, and I think it's time we put a cut in here and uh, think about what we're going to be doing uh, with our orc here in the next episode. I'm Uncle Carp. This has been Shadows of Forbidden Gods. Goodbye, bro. Thanks for watching. See you next time.